Hi, Aries. I hope you guys are doing really good. Let's find out what's going on for you. March 2024, your monthly reading. But I want to say spread. <laughs> okay. So let's see what's going on. There's a celebration here. There's a birthday party about the, that you're going to be invited to. This is like a big celebration here. Wow. I see you signing off on something. And now you can relax. Yeah. Here's your cup. There's something where you're going to take a rest. You're going to relax here. So let's see. Hmm. You're being divinely guided and protected here. I'm seeing there is a sacrifice that you're going to have to make in March. This has to do with love. I feel like there's someone that's been burdening you for a long time. And you, you love them, but at the same time, like you hate them at the same time. It's like love and hate. And I feel like this person's been just sucking the life out of you. Year of the dog, year of the monkey, year of the dragon. Yeah, you're going to be cutting ties with this person. Letter M. Yeah, you're moving on. You can't deal with this person anymore. They're, they're literally sucking the life out of you, making you sick. I see you receiving a key. So this could be a spiritual key to enlightenment. This can be a key to a home, a key to a car, or a key to a new door in your life. Life experiences here. I see a lot of chaotic energy because... You're hearing something that other people don't know. So you, you're you the first to hear, I'm, I'm hearing. You're the first one to know. There is gossip here. People are going to think that you're trying to do something behind their back, but you're actually not. But you do know things that other people don't. You have the privilege here. I'm seeing Chinese here, the dragon here. I'm also seeing Scorpio and Cancer energy as well. I'm also seeing Chinese here of the pig, letter T, letter J. Letter O and letter Q. Chinese ear of the rabbit is here as well. Yeah, there's love here. You're receiving love. Letter A. It could be coming from someone letter A. But yeah, this is something that's growing because it's in like a watering can here. I'm seeing Chinese ear of the rooster here. But you have love in the middle of the month here. Very beautiful. Chinese ear of the snake. And there's something with three. This also looks like an eight to me. So 38. But it's very small. But the third is going to be significant or three days three weeks from when you see this cup this could be happening for you chinese ear of the pig a lot at the bottom chinese ear of the pig three times here letter p you have chinese ear of the rabbit here as well yeah and the boat's moving i'm hearing your ship has sailed here so it's something's mo definitely moving on letter c here and you're receiving one single rose here so this is like a romantic thing and a door's opening up for you. Oh my gosh, Saturn's really uh, kicking your ass. I don't know. Wherever you have Saturn uh, in your chart, it's really kicking your ass here. Let her see again. Mm. Year of the Rat. <sighs> okay, something with your mother's coming up as well. Maybe you're going to be um, talking to her a lot this month. Going back and forth because I'm seeing a bell here. So there's definitely an announcement moving forward. And there's something about timing here. Everything is in divine timing for you. Like things are about to move and change because of divine timing. Well, whatever you're asking for, it's here. I'm seeing an angel right here, divinely guiding you, protecting you. There's a turtle here. So it took a long ass time, you know, turtles slow and steady, but they win the race. You know what I'm saying? I'm seeing gossip here with this uh, parrot and there's something with photography here in, in a video. I'm seeing a smiley face here, but it's like something like smile you're on camera type of shit. So you could be getting caught. So I don't know if you're trying to do something, but you could be getting caught in something. Letter K is here. Year of the dog and year of the rat is here. Also year of the pig again. So, but yeah, there's something about being on video on camera. I'm seeing junior here, JR. And number seven, year of the horse and cancer energy here. Hmm. Maybe you're doing videos. You're making videos and posting them or something. Maybe you're doing YouTube or... 
Instagram or social media. Ooh, sneaky energy here. Yeah, you're trying to get away with something. You're, you're just so overwhelmed. Maybe you're trying to take a shortcut or get out the easy way. Yeah, this could be having to do with your money, your finances here, some new opportunity. Yeah, it's in divine timing. So you are getting it, but it's in divine timing for Aries. Okay, yeah, you're going to be getting clarity and truth. It could be coming towards um, the, the um, I was going to say full moon, but the new moon, it said. So for some of you, it's the new moon. Some of you, it's the full moon or both, where you're going to be getting a lot of insight. Secrets are going to be revealed. Clarity is coming to you. This could be about love. Someone wants to, you know, give you an offer. This can be an offer of a job as well. Something you've been waiting for. It could be coming from a water sign, Pisces especially. But this is, uh, you know, March. This is Pisces season. So definitely I'm seeing this happening for you. Oh, yeah. You're going to be becoming a boss, a leader. That's you, the emperor. Yeah, yeah, look at this Scorpio too. Holy shit. Yeah, you're leaving the past behind. You're moving forward. You could be here of the GOAT. Leo is coming up as well. You could have that in your birth chart. But yeah, you're getting justice in the situation because you were patient. You were slow and steady like the turtle, right? <laughs> you know, I'm getting like Mr. Miyagi type of shit. Like you were just very graceful. Wax on, wax off, you know, like following the rules, doing what you have to do. You defended yourself when you needed to. But there's something where you're letting you're letting the universe, like you've been letting the universe take the, you know, the reins, I should say, you know, like you're letting it just happen. You don't want to be in control of this anymore. And it's bringing you more peace. Like you let go, you surrendered and you're going to be getting justice in a situation, especially if you're doing something with like law and order here. There's definitely an ending to a toxic cycle in your life. You're moving on, you're moving forward. And yeah, you're going to be collaborating. You're going to be working with a lot of different people here. Which is great. Let's see, Aries. Major challenge to overcome. Okay. Ooh, romance in the air. You could have a major challenge to overcome in uh, love, in relationships. Time to go out and have fun. Maybe you don't want to be in a relationship, but, you know, like Spirit's saying, you know, maybe mingle a little bit, you know. Go out, have some fun, stepping into a new experience and getting together with friends. So a lot of you are going to be getting together with friends. Yeah, and you're going to be divinely guided towards something. Maybe you don't want to go to something, but Spirit's saying, you know, enjoy your friends because you could be meeting someone in love when you go to this. Spiritual guidance, protection from harm. You are protected this month. Forest, muddled and unclear thinking. You're going to be getting out of this energy and there's a there's a wish that's not going to be granted to you. It wasn't meant for you. And you're going to find that out through the gossip in March. Let's see what else. For Aries, spring, your desires fully manifest as the flowers begin to bloom. Okay. Be yourself. The situation calls for you to be yourself, your most authentic self, which you guys don't have a problem with that. Winter, the answers you want are coming right now. Let's see, Aries. Debt paid off. The old weight and habit of debt is lifted from you and your life. Yeah, your wish is being granted. So you had, you didn't, okay. There was a wish that you wanted, right? It didn't happen. That's because it wasn't meant for you, all right? And for a while, you had unclear thinking, like you were, you know, muddled, unclear thinking. You had a lot of anxiety and stress. But now your wish is being granted from something else. This is because you were being patient. Ask for what you want, and that's what you did. And that's why your wish is being granted. Perfect. Assertiveness. Now you're very assertive now. You're taking action. And only say yes if you really want to and you've got the power. I'm telling you, you got the power. If you have Sagittarius in your chart, towards the middle of the month, you're really going to really feel that power. And there's going to be a lot of emotional healing for you. All right, let's see what's going on in love for you. Yeah, very soon. You're going to be meeting somebody, going out with somebody very soon. You're going to have a lot of chemistry with this person. Yeah, and this definitely could be someone that you're going to end up with for a long time, like a heavy commitment and getting met. Look at this. As I said, that wedding. 
So a lot of you could be meeting someone in love this month that's going to lead to marriage. That's going to lead to marriage here. Stay optimistic about your love life because you never gave up. You stayed optimistic. Yeah, and now you're going to be expressing your love. Ooh, this is so nice. Yeah, you're going to end up having kids with this child. The um. With this person, you're going to end up having children with this person. You're going to be flirting, have a nice time, you yeah, engagement. This is going to lead to marriage. It's going to be very beautiful. So I love that. Let's get charms for you. Aries. Oh, shit. Let's see. Alan. A L maybe something with Canada D Dylan Cassie hmm. wild yeah people are gonna think that you're wild like you have like wild ideas or something libido yeah i'm hearing let it be let it be let it be and let it be so hmm. yeah just let it be ursula umame meridian man liar yeah, I'm telling you, you're going to find out somebody lied to you. J, J and K. Could be initials here. Z. Mazda. V, I, Mavis. R. Virgo. Holy shit, look. Could have been a Virgo. Or this is someone coming towards you. E. M and M. B, what is this, J, egg, J, J, K again, mm. Y, Kyle, Kylie, Yaris, X, two X's here, mm. T, S, something about your street, your zip code could be changing here. And number five, that's the only number you have. So the fifth of the month could be significant. You're the dragon. And Taurus. Yeah, that's what's going on with that. And then you have... God. What does it say? Given you one conception and make yourselves another. So you're going to be getting a gift from God this month. Something that it's going to be like a download from God just to you. There's an invitation. There's a message here that you're going to be receiving. Oh my gosh. Yeah, definitely. Look at this. This could definitely be like a letter. You have two letters here. Maybe it's two letters. I'm hearing letter of recommendation, but yeah, two offers here. Yeah, you definitely been manifesting a lot and it's all coming true. You have a a Buddha tea leaf thing. A teacup fills drop by drop. Yeah, this again, this is like turtle energy. Yeah, and a blessing's coming to you. This is your wish being granted right here. Your wish is being granted this month. One wish that you really wanted is coming true this month. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Let me know. Comment down below. And I'll see you in the next one. Namaste. Love and light.